go. You ever wanted to hold the Death Star in the palm of your hands? There it is. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another video, and this is an impromptu video, not one that was planned to be uh, produced and even made, but I was out and about, and I come across this really, really cool uh, iHome Bluetooth speaker, uh, and, I, and I just had to grab it and, and uh, put a video out here on it. Um, as you can see, it is an illuminated Star Wars Death Star uh, speaker, so that's pretty darn cool. And uh, I figured uh, with all the hype with Star Wars coming out now, you know, with their trailer uh, for the new movie, um, this would be a great time to get a uh, video out here of this Death Star speaker. A lot of people are going to be looking for some Star Wars love and nostalgia, especially for Christmas this year and next. So uh, I went ahead and uh, let's go ahead and just open this up and take a look. And you know what? I really don't even care if this sounds good. Uh, if it looks cool, like it looks like it might. And... Uh, um, you know that that's going to be good enough for me because uh, it's it's uh, definitely kind of a novelty item. Uh, so if you can see on the box, it is just a regular old iHome uh, Death Star with lights, uh, Bluetooth speaker. Works for all tablets um, and smartphones. So Android, iOS, Windows. You should be able to uh, run this with no problems. So let's go ahead and open it up. And it looks like we do have some packaging tape here that I've got to get broke that I should have planned ahead but uh, did not see and maybe I can use my fingernail here ah, there we go alright and even more goodies what's got this on top here ah gotcha a little bit of plastic in there oh and even more on the sides oh they really did seal this up pretty good I have to go find my trusty unboxing knife here. Well, I guess we're just gonna go and destroy the box. Usually I don't like to do that, but I do not know where my trusty unboxing knife is at, and I don't want to delay. So let's go ahead and open this up. I'm sorry if I sound a little hoarse. I have been fighting a cold that will not go away. Um, going on two weeks now. Actually, didn't do any videos last week at all because I had no voice whatsoever. Um, so I'm finally getting a little bit back. So I figured I'd start producing a few more videos. So sorry if you guys were wondering uh, where I was and uh, why there haven't been that many videos. That would be why. Okay, so we've got the Star Wars speaker out. So let's go ahead and it's like something you get in like a McDonald's Happy Meal. If you remember the toys back in the day that were Star Wars. Oh yeah, that's pretty darn cool looking. So you do get, you know, a little instruction manual. Uh, looks like a USB and a 3.5 millimeter uh, jack here, so you do get some cables in the box. Uh, let's go ahead and just open these up. And as you can see, go and a little uh, velcro tie is uh, fixed to them and they are actually all one cable so you've got a 3.5 millimeter with a built-in USB so let's go ahead and just plug this in because I do not know what kind of charge it's got it looks like here's the on and off switch so let's go ahead and flick it on oh yeah that is definitely cool all right I'm going to turn out the studio lights here so you guys can see the illumination that this actually has. There we go. If you ever wanted to hold the Death Star in the palm of your hands, there it is. Well, that's, that's just darn right cool. I like it. And you can see it's got a little Bluetooth light flashing down there. So let's go ahead and get this paired up and just see how it sounds. Like I said, I don't really care if it sounds good or not. I just think it's freaking awesome. I'm going to turn the studio light back on a little bit there. So let's go ahead and pair this up. And see if we can at least determine the quality. 
And there must be a Bluetooth button that I need to press again. So let's see. Oh yeah, here it is. So let's push and hold that. Alright, so we've got a little Bluetooth light on the front. Star Wars. So it shows up on your list as Star Wars LIB18. So we're pairing to it as we speak. We could just plug this in and not even worry about it. But now we are good to go. And as you can see, our Bluetooth light is gone. It looks like it's affixed, connected. So here we go. Let's test some sound quality here and just see how, how this sounds. There we go. Let's just try this U2 one real quick. I'm going to fast forward here. Bad start to a song here. There you go, it's maximum, maximum volume there. And really, that doesn't sound too bad. I mean, you know, it's not the base, bassiest of basses or the highest of highs, but it's definitely got a good mid-round range sound to it. Um, not going to say that it sounds terrible in the least bit, so uh, I'm pleasantly surprised and very pleased with that uh, outcome there. So... Um, again, you know, you can charge this up. I don't know what it has for a built-in battery. I'm going to guess if you charge it, you're going to get maybe probably four to six hours uh, play time if you're lucky. I uh, don't anticipate it having a real good battery life from flipping the manual open as we speak. So, um, but, uh, you know, for this speaker, I really just wanted to do it based on its uh, novelty effect and that... Uh, you know, it's just a badass Dust Star Bluetooth speaker, and uh, you know, this is really just something you're going to have on your desk and and uh, sitting there and showing off. Let's just turn the light back off, and you can see, oh yeah, that's not a planet, that's a space station Bluetooth speaker. That is. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. By the way, I will have a link in the show notes where you can pick one of these up. They are not all that expensive at all. Um, and again, you know, it's uh, definitely a, a great gift idea for someone that uh, is a Star Wars lover on your Christmas list and, uh, you know, doesn't have everything Star Wars, so I bet they don't have this. But, you know, they might. But, you know, it's definitely a gamble you'd want to take because this is going to make a Star Wars lover very happy. So, again, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, a subscription to the channel. It helps us out all great great bunch I can't iterate that enough so if you like these kind of videos I do these all the time give me a subscription uh, hopefully I don't disappoint you I appreciate it as always guys thanks for watching have a good one